right. Woo! Hey, sorry. Sorry, sorry it took us a little while to get here. It took the girls a little while to get ready tonight. <laughs> hey, first of all, I want to thank you guys for sticking it out. What a great night in Georgia. <laughs> also, I also want to thank Marty and Jarrett and Lucy and Amy Porter. You know... You know, 21 months ago, we decided as a family to run for governor. I uh, certainly knew it would not be easy, but these girls, as you know, were all in and kept strong. <laughs> they, have, they have traveled this state and connected with voters, and they have put hardworking Georgians first. Tonight's celebration would not be possible without them, I'm so proud and forever grateful for their tenacity, hard work, and dedication, not only to this race, but to the people of this great state. Please help me thank them. As you all know, I've been a builder my entire life. I built my first business over 30 years ago with a pickup truck and a shovel. I've built houses, commercial buildings, and apartments. I've built companies in financial services, agribusiness, real estate, and farming. I've grown jobs and I've built opportunities in parts of our state that needed it the most. I entered public service out of frustration. I wanted to make it easier for hardworking Georgians to build a better life for their families, better communities for their kids, and better chances to achieve the American dream. So when I ran, decided to run for governor, I had a lot of ideas about policies and legislation to pass. But I built a campaign, I built this campaign on one promise, that as governor, I would put hard work in Georgians first. Yeah. I promised I promise to put people ahead of politics, even my own political party. I promise to put, put your families, not the special interest, first. I promise to put students, not the status quo, first. I promise to fight for all Georgians above all else and be a governor who cares about more about doing the right thing than playing good politics. We've traveled this state to all 159 counties to look at people eye to eye and make that promise directly. Along the way, we've rolled out comprehensive plans to strengthen rural Georgia, make Georgia number one for small business, lower taxes, lower insurance premiums, and protect the Hope Scholarship. We've talked a lot about street gangs and cartels. We've introduced plans to keep our streets and our schools safe. I stood with legislators and backed efforts to streamline the adoption process, take care of our kids in foster care, and protect the vulnerable. We've formed coalitions, and we've earned endorsements from people like President Donald J. Trump. and our Vice President, Mike Pence. But more importantly, we've gotten them from you, you all, you folks right here in this room. And over the, and as you know, over the last 21 months, we've chopped a lot of wood. We all, Marty and the girls and I cannot thank you enough for making those phone calls, writing postcards, organizing events, posting on social media. Thank you for sending in contributions, for traveling with us and doing those thankless jobs that people have to do to win a political race. Yeah. 
But most importantly, I want to thank you for believing in our campaign when no one else would. Thank you for your love and your support and your prayers. We had so many people praying for us along the way. Especially... Especially when we battled the radical left and we took on the fake news. We've also stood up to false attacks and millions of dollars coming from places like California and New York. But make no mistake, I'm very proud of Team, Team Kemp, and I'm proud of what we all have built. What an amazing night that we have had with incredible support in all four corners of our state. There are votes left to be count, to count, but we have a very strong lead. And folks, <laughs> and folks, make no mistake, the math is on our side to win this election. So I want to thank you all for staying up late to show your support. We're grateful. We're grateful for your commitment to our cause. We are waiting on the final results, but I'm confident that victory is near. And together, we will continue to work to put hard work in Georgians first and keep our state moving in the right direction. So thank you for being here tonight. God bless you. Appreciate you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.